Hi, I'm Stephanie Peter, Registered Clinical Counselor. Today I'm here to share with you a new way of looking at depression and anxiety. Most of us have heard many different explanations and suggestions. That depression is caused by low amounts of serotonin in the brain, or that negative or distorted thoughts are our main problem. We've also been told that we need to exercise, eat right, and be more assertive in order to feel better. All of these are helpful, but they don't truly get to the bottom of why we develop anxiety or depression, or why there's so much variation in the symptoms. What's really going on? Basically, the problem lies in the fact that humans are animals with big brains. Our brain circuitry controls functions that are ancient, the reptilian brain, functions that are instinctual, the mammalian brain, as well as those that are unique to humans, the rational brain and self-awareness. In many instances, we react out of our older instincts. It's not always the best way to solve a problem, but if we can understand what our body and brain are trying to do, it gives us awareness and insight into what to do next. To find out more, let's look at anxiety in more detail.